so I found my new favorite plate material, and I think you'll like it just as much as I do. I am by no means qualified to talk about the technical properties of palm or polypropylene. This is literally just smooth brain tofu preferences, and I just wanted to showcase and share with you guys one of my new favorite plate materials. My history with the palm plate dates back to when I first got my Vega, and I basically bought every single plate material, right? Alu, FR4, PC, palm, you name it, just to find my personal preference. And I settled on Palm, since that gave me the softest typing experience and had that nutty, deep, clean sound profile that just made any switch that I put in there sound great. And for the better part of two years, this config has been pretty tried and true, and also mainly the reason why I started making content in the first place. And from that point forward, whenever I got a new board, I would go out of my way to get a Palm plate cup for it. And like, I've tried other more like quote unquote like exotic plates before, like Unwipe and Carbon Fiber, but my latest discovery of Polypropylene, or PP, has become my new go-to. So nerding out a little bit, Palm, or commonly known as Delrin, is an acetal thermoplastic that's used to make like gears, fittings, and sliders, but we use that shit for fucking switches and plates. Uh, polypropylene, on the other hand, is a polymer thermoplastic that's commonly used for Tupperware. So why polypropylene? One of the reasons is that it's a lot softer and more flexible than Palm, so there's very little risk of you snapping a plate like I've done before. Well, it's not gonna snap, look at that. Like, oh, it did snap. It could potentially crease, but you can always just kind of like bend it back. And personally, whether using tactiles or linears of any kind, I still prefer that softer and plush typing experience that Palm and Polypropylene have offered. And the other reason is just how it sounds. I've always enjoyed a slightly deeper sounding profile that doesn't come across as like the muted, muddy sound that polycarbonate plates can have. And I can't use Palm for every single board, and sometimes it just doesn't want to work. Personally, I found that the alphas on Polypropylene sound pretty bright, clean, and depending on the board that you put it in, especially in the case of my Jane, it can make that spacebar hit different. So I get it, it's probably not the most economical thing to do to go out and get a plate cut for every single board you own or will own, but if you're looking to get a plate cut, I got all of mine sourced from Umbra, link in the description, who can definitely help you. I know there's already a considerable amount of decision fatigue in this hobby, right? With new boards, switches, keycaps coming out like every other week. And my boy Abby did a great video on this topic, so check that out. But I will recommend a decision for your next build is picking up a polypropylene plate. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys. Let me know what you think of this like Ungo Bunga flexi plate. And have a happy new year and I'll see y'all soon.